Today in prayer, the Lord began to speak. He told me to share with the people what he has told me. He told me to tell you all, there is a shift that is taking place. He is God and the earth is his. Everything within it is his. He is the God over heaven and earth and he will do a new thing. He told me to tell you all who he is. He is the Lord God, your father, and he hears you. He has seen the things you have done and he wants you to know. He wants you to change. He wants you to shift. He said you all have been busy and he is slowing things down. You all have been concerned about yourselves and he is slowing you down. He will shift the atmosphere to change. He wants you to know that he hears you and sees you in everything that you do. You want hope and he has given it to you. You want change and it is before you. If you do not change, the earth will be over. He is coming back and he will answer you. He will tell you who he is. He said you have been serving other gods and he wants you to change. Change you to know who he is. He is God and he is his name. He is the Lord God, Jehovah, the Lord of all the earth. He is the one who can change it. He said, listen to me and I will tell you who I am. I will show you what I can do. I can do anything because I am God. I am the one who helped you. I am the one who hears you. I can do anything because everything that is here is mine. I am God, listen to me. I have shown you things to do and you have not listened. You have not done what I told you to do. I told you to change and you did not. You did not shift when I told you. You did the very thing I told you not to do. I told you to listen to me and you did not answer. You did not let me show you who I am. I told you to shift and now I will. I will change the earth. I will change it for who I am. I will take it away. I will take the people off the earth if they will not answer my call. I'm calling out to the people to hear my voice. Hear me when I am speaking to you. Show me you will change. Show me you will listen to my words. Show me that you know who I am. Show me that you will do what I ask of you. I am telling you who I am. I am God, the one who loves you. I love you so much and you do not listen. You call out to me, but you do not answer when I call. You do your own things and think that I don't see you when I do. For I am God, the one who sees you. You pick up things I tell you to put down. You show me things that are displeasing to me. You show me that you think that you can change, that you can change the earth. When I am the one who created it and I will change it. It is mine and I have it in my hand. I will crumble it if it does not answer my call. I will take people away if they will not hear me. I have asked of you to do many things and you will not answer. You are stubborn and do not listen. You are my people and I love you. I want you to know that I love you. I can only do things according to my will. I want you to do new things. I will hold the earth in my hands and I will change it. I can do anything. You want the earth to remain and you want the clouds to not change, but I will, for you have not answered in my name. You have called me by another. You call out to a God who is not me. You say you know things and you do not. You say you answer me and you do not. You do not answer my call. You shift things that I have told you not to. You do things that I have not told you to do. You answer to man and not to me. You listen to man and not to me. I told you I was coming and you did not answer. I told you to wait for me and you did not come. You will answer me today. You will show me that I am your God. Listen to my words. I want you to live. I want you to prosper. I want health for you. But I will listen. I will change the earth. I will answer the call. Listen to me, Shervis. I will tell you what I want them to know. I want them to know that I am God. I am the Lord Jehovah. I am their God. 
I am the one who was with them in every storm. I heard them and I answered their cry. I heard them when they cried out to me and I told them who I am. I showed them my power and they still did not change. I told them I would heal them and they still would not change. I told them I could help them and they still would not change. I showed them I could shift it, but they still did not change. They are a stiff necked people who do not change unless the earth will shatter. Then they will hear me and know that I am their God. I will show them who I am and I will change them. I will deliver them if they listen out for my name. I am the God of everything. I am the Lord of their land and I will heal them if they call out to me and tell me who I am to them. I will talk to them and show them who I am. I will answer them and tell them everything they need to know. I will give them the answers. I will help them. I will show them what to do. I will not let them be consumed by the fire that should come, only if they will answer. If they will not answer, then I will not come and heal their land. I will let it go away. I will change it forever in my name. I will show them my power and my might that I will not fail and I will not faint. I am God, the one who changes not. I cannot fail and I will not. I will show them who I am today. I will show them my power. I will shift the atmosphere and show them what I can do. I can do anything. I can show them new things. I can take them to new heights. I can do all things because I am the great I am. I am the Lord Jehovah God of heaven and earth. I will do a new thing and shift the atmosphere. Behold, I will do a new thing. Shall you not know it when I come? I will behold the earth and it shall be mine. I will let it answer me when I call. I am coming and I am on the way. Behold, if they will not answer, the earth shall be all mine and the people will not. They will not know my name and they will not see my glory. They will hold to their hands and be people of night. They will not see brightness, but only night. They will not know glory and they will not know light. They will hold to their hand a thing that is not glory. They will see darkness on all the earth if they will not hold out their hands to me. Give me the rest. Give me the rest that you have. Show me where you need me to be. Show me where you want me to be in your heart. Take me for who I am. I am God, the Lord Jehovah, your God. I will not answer you if you will not seek me. Seek me and know my face. Know who I am. Know me when you see me. I am the one walking in the wind. I am the one troubling the sea. I am the one who the waters do call by name. I am the Lord God, your father. I hear you and I know you are confused and you wonder who I am and if I can do a thing, but know that I can. I can do anything because I am everything. Everything you said you need, I am. I am the one who can heal the land. I am the only one who can shift it. I am the only one who knows what to do. If you want to know what to do, hear me and seek my voice. When I answer the call of my people, they will call out to me and I will answer. I will answer to their cry. I will know them by name and hear who they are and know what they need. I will need them to show me who I am to them. Show me who I am to you. Show me that I am your God. Live your life for me. Show me that I can do anything through you. Be who you are created to be. Be who I'm telling you to be. Be the man I called you to be. Be the woman I called you to be. Be the man I made you to be. Be the woman I made you to be. Be who I called you to be. You are the one, Shervis. You are the one I called to be this. You are the one I've chosen to be this. You are the one who hears me. You told me you wanted to help people. You wanted them to know that I am God. You wanted them to see me through you and that what I am doing, I'm doing a new thing through you and I will show you who I am. 
I will show you that I have you, that I am the one who keeps you from bondage. I will take a lack of faith and build it upon a rock that will not stand on its own, but on a rock that will stand against the rain and the wind. When it comes, it will shift an atmosphere. And when the wind does come and the rain does fall, but the rock will stand and it will not be moved because I am in the rock. I am the rock on which you stand and I am the ground on which you do not shake. I am the God, the Lord God, and I am the mighty one, the deliverer of all the earth, and I will heal your land if you answer unto me. Answer me today. Tell me your ways will be changed. Tell me you're not too busy. Tell me you can do the things I have asked of you. Tell me you will call out to me in due time. Tell me you will hearken unto my voice. Tell me you will change with the earth. As it shifts, so will you. You will adapt to the changes the Lord God will make in you. You will change not in answer to me. You will fail not in answer to me. You will be what I call you to be. You will be the one who calls out to my name and shifts the atmosphere. You will be the one who surrenders all and calls upon me and show me the daily works of my hands. Hold on to me and I will give you rest. I will cause a rest upon you all. I will show you who I am. I will answer you and call you by name. I will show you that I am your God. Call upon me and I will give you rest. I will put my rest upon you and you will shout to the heavens that I am God, that I am the Lord God. I am the Lord God of heaven and earth and I fail not and that I have shifted the earth and changed it forever. I will change it forever for you. For you are my people and I love you. I love you so much and I will answer you. I will keep you close in my heart. I will hide you from the pestilence of this earth. I will change you and keep you from all that will want to harm you. I will keep you from the arrows of the earth, the ones who do not bring me glory. I will cover you with the arms of my angels. I will keep you in my arms and carry you through the night. I will ship the earth for you. I will keep you from harm if you will answer me. You must answer to me and know that I am your God and that I will not leave you nor forsake you. I will give you rest and my rest will be upon you. You will carry out your days of hunger and thirst and I will feed you. I will give you water for your thirst. I will give you hope for your future. I will give you my hand in marriage. I will marry you unto me and change who you are. I will make you my bride and I your bridegroom. I will be the man that stands by your side when you are in trouble. I will be the one that humbled you to know who I am. I am your God, the one who loves you, the one who helps you, the one who hears you. I will take you into heaven where I am and I I will give you rest. I will repeat the things I have done for you and give you power over the serpents. I will give you an anointing that will fail not. I will show you that I can do anything. I will give the land a power that will prevail. You will not prevail without me. You can do no thing without me. I am who you need in this hour. If you will call upon me, I will give you what you need. I will show you who I am. I will shift the earth and change it for all to see. I will seek out people who will call out my name and know who I am, that I am their God. They will not answer to another but to me. They will not seek other gods but me. They will know my name, and when I call them, they will answer. They will answer unto me and show me that I am the one who hears them, and I am the God who can help them out of this pestilence in the land. I will take heed to my people and will listen to them. I will hear their hearts and open their minds to new things. I will show them. I will show them who I am. I will show them that I am not a God who lies, that I tell the truth, that I will shift anything that I need to, to bring me glory. Because of my glory, you are not consumed. You are my riches. You are my glory. You are the one whom I choose to put my hope in. You are my Lord God, my Jehovah, the wonderful one, the one who is full of wonder and do praise, the one who will shift the heavens and earth for his sake. For he said he would deliver us if we call. He is the one who can change us. He is the one who will answer us, the one who we need. 
We need him and he will answer us. He will listen to us and show us new things. He will shift the atmosphere and change the things about us that do not bring him glory. He will take the earth and shift it to his name, shift it to the place where he can dwell and be called upon to answer us in due season. He is the one who is God and the one who fails not. Listen to the Lord your God and he won't fail. He will not fail you to see the coming of his day. The day he comes for you, you will be there to answer that I am he, that I am she who you called and I answered. I answered you and you heard my cry. I cried to you and you called out to me by name. And I said, here I am, Lord, send me, I will go. I will go where you tell me to go. I will answer the call you will give to me. I will show you who I am and I am a child of God. I am the one who he says he loves. I'm the one who he sent to tell you the truth. I am not one to lie nor one to boast. I am not one who will answer a fake call. I will not shift myself to something that does not answer. I know the Lord God and I know his voice. His voice is the only one I will answer and his call is the only one I will go to and do whatever he says do. I will do what the Lord says and I will answer him and I will call him by name, Lord Jehovah, and I will tell him to give me rest. Rest my mind on things of you. Help me to see you in everything I do. Help me to shift the atmosphere and change the earth. Help me to show the people who God is. He is the one who cannot fail. He is the one who knows your heart. He will open up to you and show you new things you thought you could never see. The things hidden in your heart. He knows. He knows the things you hunger for. He knows that you have a thirst. He knows that you wonder about him. And if he can truly give you rest, but I tell you, he can. He can do anything you ask him to do. He will not fail. He is God who never fails and never gives up. He did not give up hope on you. He did not watch you fail. He watched you grow. He showed you. You can live again. You can do again. You can be again. You can go again and do the things he will tell you to do. He will shift you to do great things for him if you let him in. Let him in your heart. Show him who you are and who he is to you. Show him that he is your God, the one who loves you, the one who died for you, Jesus is your God. Your father God in heaven had sent him for you. He brought him down for you to know him and how to live before him, but you did not know his name. Know his name today, that he is God, the Lord God of heaven and earth, the one who said he would be there for you, the one who will shift the atmosphere for you if you let him in. Let him in. Let him show you he can be your God and you can be his child, the one who can love him and serve him all the days of your life. Don't answer the call of the enemy, which tells you to do nothing, to stand there and judge others, to be anything you want to be and become whoever you want to be. Be who God called you to be. Be the Lord's sons and daughters. Be the Rapha's ones who listen to him. Be the one who restores faith in others. Be the one who will shift atmospheres and bring God glory. Be the one who will listen to the Father and he will give you rest. Rest for your souls and rest for your strength because the world needs you to be rested. Rested to fight for the days coming. The ones where people will not answer him and they will lack faith the ones when people will not know the Lord's voice. And when he calls out to them, they will not hear. They will not know him as you do. You will have to be the ones who will change the earth to know him. You will have to be the ones who will answer to him, that he will know you and you will know his voice, that he will answer you and you will seek him. For he will show you new things and will not cause your feet to wander, but to be in place and show you all the things that bring him glory. That you will be the one who does what the father tells you to do. That you will be the one who he promised to love and cherish and be with you all your days. 
that you will be the one who answers the call today. Do not wait until tomorrow, for it is not promised. But today is yours to take hold and decide to change. Change your home. Change your fears and your worry. Change your confusion to know him. He will show you what you will need to do. When he tells you the answer, answer the Lord today. His call out to you. His call for you to know his name and answer him. Answer him today and he will give you rest. Rest in the Lord, oh, our souls. Rest in his holy name. Rest in the Lord Jehovah forever and ever. Amen. Thank you, Lord, for we have rest in your great name forever. Amen and amen.